Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, my name is Hani Salsan Alia from the Faculty of Tarbiyah and Teacher Science Majoring in the Department of English Education In this video, I am going to explain you uh, what is lexical field So, lexical field is basically a set of words grouped by meaning referring to a specific subjects For example, clothing. Clothing, as you all know, is a quote collectively. So in clothing, there are like dress, sweater, and shirt, etc. So what is dress? Dress is, um, is a noun, which is a one-piece garment that covers the body and extends down over the thighs or legs. And it is typically worn by girls or women. For example, for this word, is a red silk dress. The second word, which is sweater. Sweater is a noun. So, what is a sweater? Sweater is a knitted garment, typically with long sleeves and worn over the upper body. For example, for this word, is he is wearing a close knit um, sweater for today's icy weather. Third is shirt. Shirt is a noun. And what is a shirt? A shirt is a garment that is um, used for the upper body of cotton or a similar fabric with a color, sleeves, buttons down the front. For example, for this word is today um, he is wearing a shirt for today's job interview. Hello, my name is Lamina. I'm here to explain style. Style is the level of informality and formality of words or phrase. Example, ask and inquire. The informal one is ask and the formal one is inquire. Ask is meant to speak or write to someone in order to get information, answer, and a solution. And inquire is meant to ask someone for information example don't ask him and why are you doing that the boy inquired and the next word is check and verify the informal one is check and the formal one is verify check is mean to do something in order to find out whether <laughs> whether something really is correct true or in good condition and verify is to discover whether something is correct or true example a first rule in find out any mystery is to check the fact and a computer program verifies that the system is working and the next word is wrong and incorrect the the informal one is wrong and the formal one is incorrect. Wrong is mean not correct or not based on true fact. And incorrect is mean not correct or true. Example, your calculation must be wrong. And the information you gave us was incorrect. Hello, my name is Sala Ale Haris, and the last material is uh, connotation. Connotation is an emotional or cultural association attached to words beyond its literal meaning. For example, different and unique. Uh, different means not like something or someone else, or not like for for example her pencil is different than mine so uh, unique is being only one of its kind for example zebra has unique pattern among other animals the next uh, example is proud and confident proud means feeling pleased about something that you have done or something that you own or about something that you involved with a relationship
creative. For example, my parents proud of me because I'm being a winner. So the next is confident. Confident means sure that something will happen uh, the way that you uh, want or expect. For example, Arya is confident with his exam results. So the next or the last uh, example is group and gang. A uh, group means several people or things uh, that are all together in the same place. For example, we're divided into some groups for the study tour. Uh, the next is a gang. A gang means a group of young people who a group of young people who spend time together and uh, who are often involved in a crime or drugs or who often uh, fight against the groups. For example, uh, the motorbike gangs always uh, makes disaster. So this is the last of us. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.